Hello all my Hollow Maniacs out there, welcome back to the channel, it's so great to see you again, and this series will just never die, will it? I've tried to kill it twice, but it keeps coming back from the dead! Like, I have a wheel of impressions on Twitch, I swear, over half of them, throughout the entire time I've been doing Twitch, have been Franken voices. I did that survey a while back about what types of videos y'all like more. Franken voices wasn't even an option, but so many people put it, it became an option. So Franken voices will just never die, apparently. And I guess today is another episode of Franken voices. <laughs> So for those of you guys who have never seen this before, let me explain how this works. Fringin' Voices is a game where we take two impressions and we mix them together to create a brand new voice. Normally, I have a bowl that I draw two names out of, but now I figured you guys could decide for me. So I asked online what you guys would want to see and you guys gave me your answers and so here we go. But before we get to the Franken Voices, I just want to do a quick little shout out. I am still doing the sweepstakes giveaway for uh, the Disney gift cards. If you guys want to join, you've got another week. If you guys want to enter to win the $50 one, go download the link in the description. Disney Emoji Blitz. Play the game until you score a million points in one round. It sounds hard, but it's actually pretty easy. Screenshot your score and then post a picture of it on Twitter or Instagram and tag me in it. But if you're doing it on Instagram, don't do a story. Those go away, I can't find them. And then if you want to be entered to win the $100 gift card, you have to play Disney Emoji Blitz and get to level 50 if you're 50 or above, and then just post the same way you would the other one, and then you'll be entered to win. So you guys still have some time, so get on that. All right, let's do more Reagan voices. So the first one we have is what would Porky Pig and Sid the Sloth sound like together? Oh, we got a double speech impediment, y'all. Double speech impediment. <laughs> so what does a uh, Porky Pig and Sid the Sloth Sound like together? Eep, 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 uh, that's all, folks. <laughs> eep, 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 uh, isn't there anyone who cares eep, 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 about shit? Eep, 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 the slow, eep, 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 the slow, eep, 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 the slow mammal. <laughs> <laughs> that one weirdly works. I could see a character whip out a lateral lisp and then a, eep, 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 a stutter. So then you just really throw on the, eep, 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 the, the hard to understand factor. <laughs> Uh, next one, Doofenshmirtz and Stitch. I feel like that's just gonna turn into Gollum, but let's try it. Oh, uh, so what does Stitch and Doofenshmirtz sound like together? You know, if I had to decode for every single time someone came up to me and said, Oh, Hanneman's family, I would have two nickels. I mean, it's not a lot of nickels, but it's weird that it happened twice, you know what I mean? Actually, no, I would have a lot more nickels than that. That's everyone's favorite thing to say to Stitch. Well, I was working on this one. It either came out as Gollum or Fred Fred Burger. It's, <laughs> I was able to find this combination of the two, but it was really easy to go to one of these two. <laughs> Speaking of Gollum, the next one is the Mad Hatter and Gollum. So what do the Mad Hatter? <laughs> oh, the Gollum. Sound like together? Last process, we have some lovely tea for you, a nice spot of tea. <laughs> oh, I do love a tea party. Yes, I do, precious. And a nice taters, boil a mess, some stew. in stew. I know that's what Sam said, but I can actually see the Mad Hatter enjoying some potatoes. <laughs> I don't know if this character is going to hug you or hurt you. Or both. I didn't realize how many Stitch and Gollum characters I picked, but I guess I did. I guess I was on a Stitch and Gollum kick when I picked this. So next one is Stitch and King Julian. This will be interesting. Oh, so what does Stitch and King Julian sound like together? I like to move it, move it. You like to move it, move it. You like to move it. Oh, come on. What is a simple bite on the buttocks among Ohana? Here, give me a nibble. Ohana means family, and family means that everyone worships King Julian, but it does, man. Batman and Yoda, of course we're gonna get some Batmans in this one, so let's do it. So what does Batman mm, and Yoda <laughs> sound like together? Strong with the force you are, but not ready to handle Vader or Joker you are. Fight more you must, learn more you must, and become strong. In both strength and the force, you must become. Prove to you the city has. Do whatever it will for good. I just picture this as one of Yoda's contemporaries, and he's like the crazy one. So, you know, Yoda's over there. Mm, think about this, we must. No, battle we must. Fight to the... Mm, calm yourself, you must. Carl! Dang, Carl! 
<laughs> and yes, his name is Carl. Jim, Carl! That would be a, I, I'd pay money to see that. All right, next one we have is Joker and Taz. Oh my gosh, this is going to just, this is going to be the most evil sounding thing you've ever heard in your life. So what does the Joker? Uh, and Taz. Sound like together? Oh, Batman. <laughs> it is I, the Joker. Tazoka, Tazoka. It sounds like tapioca, but it's more deadly. <laughs> I'll take sounds that should never come out of the human mouth for 500. A three character Franken voice? A three character Franken voice? Sure, why not? I think this is Franken Voices history. I think this is the first time we've ever had this one. I've had this happen on streams, but never happened in a Franken voice. So let's see what happens. So what does Mickey, Roy, and Goofy, I'm Donald, sound like together? Oh, gosh, pals. Great to kill ya. Hot dog, hot dog, hot dog, hot dog. <laughs> Maybe it's just me, but it kind of sounds like what happens if you take a Tickle Me Elmo doll, run it over an 18-wheeler, and... Still press the button. Don't ask me how I know that. All right, next one we have Sid the Sloth and Mater. Okay, we're gonna have a lateral lisp on a country voice. I'm okay with this. So what does Sid the Sloth? <laughs> Plus Mater. Sound like together? No, I'm on one of those there special diets. I'm a patient instrument of speed and aromatics. As in that anyone who cares about Sid the Sloth, I tell you what. That went a little too well together. That went a little too well together. That one made you get filed away for future voices. That one, that one kind of worked. What about the two best friends, Lumiere and Cogsworth? Why not? Let's give it a shot. Uh -huh. And what does Lumiere and Cogsworth sound like together? Oh, how lovely that would be. It's so lovely for you to be able to spend the night here in the castle. I'm conflicted amongst myself whether we should have a lovely feast or to go straight to bed with just a crust of water and a, a crust of water. With a glass of water and a crust of bread. I don't know which one. Just take a pick. It's like Sean Connery if he was a butler. I don't hate that. We're getting some good ones here, y'all. We're getting some good ones here, y'all. Y'all are good at this. We need to do another one of these. This is good. All right, next up we have Mickey Mouse mixed with Grunkle Stan. Oh, this is going to be just a crime against cartoons. Oh, boy. And what is Mickey Mouse? Plus Grunkle Stan. Sound like together? Oh, boy. Hiya there. My name is Mickey Stan. And so should you hide all the government papers? We don't want Goofy to find them. Uh -huh. Apparently, Goofy works for the IRS now. <laughs> Not gonna lie, if Goofy did work for the IRS, it, I think doing my tax would be a lot more fun. <laughs> All right, next up, we have Pooh and Dracula. Ooh, that'd be fun. So what does Winnie the Pooh bear? And Dracula. Sound like together? Oh, I don't say blah, blah, blah. But I do have a rumbly in my tumbly. If you don't mind giving me a smack roll of honey and maybe some near blood or blood substitute on the side, you can't tell the difference. It slowly got more and more Dracula. We were losing a little bit more of poo. Okay, we already did that one. Okay, we already did that one. That oh, oh, okay! <laughs> Now it's no secret that Bat Poo is by far the most popular Franken voice I've ever done. So, we're going to end the return of Franken voices again with Bat Poo. Again. <laughs> I am the honey coated Dark Knight who looks over all of Arkhamwood, the hundred acres of Arkhamwood. And it is my job to make sure that I keep all the citizens safe. From Eeyore to Rabbit to Commissioner Gordon. To everyone, I will keep you safe. And that is my word. Because I'm the hero that you deserve. But not the one you need right now. But the one who deserves a smack roll of honey. And a lot of it. Oh. So that's it for more Franken voices. Let me know in the comments if you guys want to see more of this. I'm sure you do. I am not shocked at all. <laughs> Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys later. Bye. Bye.